So the combat assault rifle is now fully in the game and it's going to be the same to find as basically any other gun. I don't have much ammo here unfortunately but you're going to be able to get it out of chests, floor loot, supply drops, literally everything. Basically it's just the exact same as how you would find a normal assault rifle or something. However for the first few hours after this weapon actually won the vote it wasn't actually properly in the loot pool for I hadn't activated it yet. But now I think it's like three hours after and they have activated it. So yeah again you'll be finding it just like normal assault rifles. So on floor loots, just on the ground, in chests, supply drops, stuff like that. And I want to see if I can find one person to fight and show you guys a bit of gameplay of this gun if you haven't already seen some now. Unfortunately, I don't have too much ammo like I was saying. This is what I'm talking about. So there's, for example, just a normal assault rifle as floor loot. I don't know why I picked that up. And then you can see there was a combat assault rifle just on the floor here as well. So that's how you're going to find it as floor loot. Right, there's a guy in a truck here. Yeah, I'm about to get run over. So you can see there, it's not hitting a player, but that sort of gives you an idea of the damage. Now the range on it isn't great, I don't think, considering it's an assault rifle, mainly because the recoil. The problem is I can't properly like show you in a video how the recoil works, because if I'm controlling it, you won't even be able to tell, and unfortunately I don't really have a full clip to just shoot for the sake of looking at the recoil pattern. Basically, it's just going to keep on going up and up and up as you're trying to shoot. Now there is someone here. A little bit 25 damage there. I don't like my chances of being able to kill this guy with it just because I only have 32 bullets, but we will see. A bit more damage. <laughs> okay, the, I didn't quite get him with that, but I still think I'll include that anyway because it blocked off his launch pad there. But yeah, when I have a bit more ammo later in this game, I'll just shoot an entire clip without like actually moving my mouse and show you just how much the uh, recoil this is going to kick up. Alright, I've got a little bit more ammo now, so I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. So I'm not going to move my mouse at all here, and you'll see just how much it's going to, like, the crosshair is going to go up. Like I say, it goes up to that point, but then if you pull down, and then keep shooting, it's going to keep going back up. So basically the entire time, as you're spraying this at someone or shooting at someone, you're going to have to be, like, pulling down on it so that it actually stays on the target. Otherwise, as you saw there, it just goes way above where you were aiming originally. So spraying through builds is going to be something this gun is quite good at. Obviously with such a um, fast fire rate, this guy just blocks himself in. Um, it's not going to do, I mean any gun is a bad idea against the um, armored walls to be honest, so no surprises there. I'm just trying to, oh he's dead. I think I'm dead as well if I'm looking carefully. I was just trying to focus on mainly using this new gun. As you can see there, that's not really going to do much for you just because the spread on this thing is crazy. But what you can do is just run it. This is going to be very, very good for like, uh oh. Um, aim assist players. Because as you saw there, it is very, very easy to just like run into someone. Right, so there's someone over here. Don't shoot the people while you're in mid-air if you're using it with a shockwave. Oh wow, okay. So it's not unbeatable, as you saw that that guy hit a massive pump on me. But I was still tagging him pretty hard. It's probably one of my favorite new weapons I've had in a while. Definitely my favorite assault rifle at the moment. Let me know what you guys think of this new weapon down below though. And if you have any more questions, comment down below as well. And as always, if you want to support me as a creator, that is going to be code Kanga in the Fortnite item shop. Otherwise though, that's it for me for now, and I will see you all next time. See ya!